All right, let's do it for the controller. Almost looks like Reach. Like the. Yeah, the remake. Halo C anniversary. Not quite. A blind job. How did they... At least from a distance. Like, I am very impressed with the we graphical update yes. that was done. No These textures are really damn sharp for the game engine. Not on every character, but then that would be a ton of work again. So. Should turn on subtitles, I think. Well, that's it then. Bring the ship back up to combat alert alpha. I want everyone at their stations. Everyone, sir? Everyone. And Cortana. Hmm? Let's give our old friends a warm welcome. I've already begun. I really like the added stuff to the cinematics, like the ODSTs over there. Very well done. I wonder if they got a uh, straight up uh, redone from Halo 2. Like, just ripped out some, somehow, and then remodeled. They look like the Halo 2 ones. Are they the Halo 2 ones? That's a Sparrowhawk. And they were mongooses. Yeah, the audio mixing is just not very good in Halo 1. That's a big ass machine gun. So hot for that they're scrambling over each other to get it. Well, I don't care if it's God's own anti son of a bitch. My favorite thing. There's a belly full of lead and a pool of their own blood to drown in. Am I right, Marie? I want a giant hula hoop. Yeah, I don't think Johnson is an upgrade, actually. Unfortunately, a lot is an upgrade, but not everything is. Anyway, there's DMRs and battle rifles, so this is gonna be your lucky day. yeah, his his mouth animation isn't uh, on point. I feel. Hey, masters. Sure. Right. Let's thaw him out. Ah, uh, okay. Bringing low-level systems online, cracking the case in 30 seconds. Yeah, guys, Masters is uh, the project lead for uh, SPV3. Thanks for stopping by, man. Ooh, that's an added scene. It's like... It's like in the books, pretty much, right? Is it an elite? A M controller, please. Oh my god, the controller doesn't work. Boys, we're in trouble. Uh, shit. <laughs> we got derped. All right, we'll just save here. Get back. Sort it out. Yes. Please work. Why you no work? No. 
I guess I gotta do something in the launcher. I'll check that super quick. Sorry, boys, interrupting the action and crap. Anyway, uh, I believe there are subtitles, right? There are no subtitles. That's a shame. What? Was the video set up? No, it's correct. Okay, anyway, uh, I was in the control setup and uh, I've got it all enabled. So it's an enabled peripheral. It should be fine, but I'm thinking if I go over here, not here, but here. We do just MCC. And, uh, yeah, should be good. Ah, all oh, my windows jumping everywhere. Oh, you're at PAX. Well, especially thank you for stopping by in that case. Yeah, it's in the profile, so... Now it works! I just needed to uh, sign it probably in the... in the thingy, in the launcher. Right, let's actually kick some ass. Did the guys hide anything in this area? Ooh, is this new? Just messing about a bit. Anything behind here? No. <laughs> I, I just, I'm just wondering how creative they got. Uh... Oh, big shout out to Hidden Xperia then. Alright, let's go boys. And I believe up there, there was in fact an elite. I believe in the book it's some uh, badass back ops dudes that go in there. And they're the same guys that later get to the bridge, I believe. Oh, the plasma effect. So much nicer. Holy crap. Oh, it's a sword lead. Oh shit, son! I can't even punch him because <laughs> I don't have any guns. That's a one of the shortcomings I always thought uh, Halo could have done better. All of the Halo games, when you don't have a weapon, why can't you punch? That's so weird. See you around, and again, thanks for stopping by, That's that was very cool. These hunters are also a new addition here, and they get locked off. Right, these guys are all the same. But then there's a machine gun on the wall, on the ceiling. What the heck? Brutes! Oh! This is very hype, boys. Oh no! No, the funny panel. Man, that's a shame. I like the funny, pa funny panel. This is a very cool addition, like... It never had a symbol anywhere on the ship. Uh, like the Spirit of Fire does. But... Yeah, I love that. Very nice addition to the uh, ambience of the bridge. Captain Keys. Good to see you, Master Chief. Things aren't going well. Cortana did her best, but we never really had a chance. A dozen Covenant superior battleships against a single Covenant class 
With those odds, I'm content with three. Make that four kills. Sleep well? Mm, I have to say, I'm not a huge fan of the Cortana upgrade. I believe the original is better. Sorry, boys. It must have been one of their boarding parties. I guess an antimatter charge. I, I, I can clearly see uh, what you guys were trying. A much more detailed face, but it just doesn't work out with the engine, maybe. That means you too, Cortana. While you do what? Go down with the ship? In a manner of speaking. The object we found, I'm going to try and land the autumn on it. With all due respect, sir, this war has enough dead heroes. I appreciate your concern, Cortana, but it's not up to me. The protocol is clear. Destruction or capture of a shipboard AI is absolutely unacceptable, and that means you're leaving ship. Lock in a selection of emergency landing zones, upload them to my neural lace, and then sort of... <laughs> Looks like a Canadian. <laughs> aye, aye, <sir. laughs> oh, Captain Squiggles, that was a good one. Which is where you come in, Chief. Get Cortana off this ship. Keep her safe from the enemy. If they capture her, they'll learn everything. Force deployment, weapons research, Earth. I understand. Original one scared you. Where did you get touched, Captain Squiggles? Just letting my subroutines handle the final approach. Excellent work, Cortana. Thank you. Are you ready? You know, when Cortana originally faded in for the first time, that animation... Is that from Halo 3? It just flared right now. <clears throat> so hard to hear. It's not loaded, boys. Like, in the original, you would just get the gun, you don't have a weapon, according to the UI, then you walk out there, some grunts arrive, and suddenly you have ammo. Continuity, what the hell, Bungie? <laughs> uh, these guys fixed it. Really good job. Paying attention to the details. And Halo is as beautiful as ever. Well done. Very well done. That's so much detail. So much detail. Yes, Captain Skiggles, that too. When they even put that here, awesome. It feels very different. Um, the pistol. Do what you do best. Sounds wow, completely redone. Wow, I'm taking way more damage than normal. I have to be way more accurate with this pistol, holy crap. Oh, and I already expired. Uh, it's because they have the bleeding on the... Right. I keep trying to switch with uh, RB, but it's actually X. Might want to change that later. Yeah, reload is also X, so I'm not sure I'm liking that very much. I'll probably change that on the next level. I'm not used to this. That's an SMG over there, so we'll probably pick that up. Yeah, the spam shooting with the plasma pistol is still very strong, I like that. So, do we want to pick up this? Oh, I'm sorry, Captain Skills. What are you referring to? About Promethean leaders and all that? You mean that Cortana's butt is just as important, or...? <laughs> oh yeah, Dave, I, I know that one. 
These guys don't seem to be coming out. What's going on? Oh, this SMG is actually not bad. Holy crap. Way more difficult to aim and there's no actual uh, reticle assist. Is there still an overshield in there? Hey, let me in. Auto turret? I'm activating that. Ooh, extra game mechanics. Very nice. Data pad. Oh, oh my god, they added lore. This is so cool. Okay. Uh, no Gamora me. Uh, CIS Seeker of Truth. That's, I'm guessing, the carrier um, that he's on. What does CAS stand for again, guys? Help me out here. Anyway, he's a Sangeli uh, Major Domino? I'm not sure what Domino refers to here. How is this possible? These beasts and their ships, so primitive, so weak, so filthy and vile, have led us to what we have desired to find for eons. We have found Halo at last, but how did they lead us here? Do they know something we do not? I saw the commander's mandibles curl as we exit the slip space after following the human ship. It is he who will be credited for taking us to his holy relic, but even he knows that, bizarrely, it is the vermin who are responsible for the discovery. Had Orna Medama not perished in the attack by the demons on the human world of Kotazor, he would have found this place. And his fleet had at least found a relic that was foretold to bring us here. Thanks for the follow there. Where was I? Oh shit, I lost. Yeah, his path to glory was thwarted by the humans' demons, uh, who detonated one of their crude devices, turning the city and the relic with it into smoldering ash. And with the relic, our only hope of finding Halo. This is where these savages must be extinguished. They have no respect for the gods. Left unchecked, they will destroy their relics and do everything they can to stop us from ascending as the great journey begins. But it is these heretics, these humans, who will taint this relic with their presence after we have searched, it, searched for it for so long. Yeah, I know it's a carrier, I'm just not sure what it exactly stands for. Hey! There were two of them. Ah, uh, crap. What if I leave it offline? I'm just curious how that will look. <laughs> That's awesome.
Need to not die now. Ah, okay. But that doesn't make sense, Captain Squiggles. That's not the initials. Wouldn't it be Carrier Assault class? Or Carrier Assault ship? I'm actually not sure, I'm just asking. Any more hidden stuff? No. What about those marines though? Oh! I completely missed this opportunity. That sucks. Alright, let's go. Yeah, that would have made that fight so much easier. Man, it's way harder to get a headshot with the pistol. I like that rebalance a lot. It's not bonkers anymore. <laughs> Let's see how the assault rifle does. It's uh, seemingly the Halo 3 version. Ooh. No way. Oh, that's what you got? Okay, I'll believe it. It's weird that the elites are using uh, plasma pistols, but it's nice for variety, I suppose. Ah, uh, run! Oh, don't wanna... ...lose my shields there. fire rate on this thing seems a bit low, although it's probably just the sound. And I'm being confused. Alright. We're gonna have to noob combo these guys, I find. Noise. Oh, wow, it automatically releases. I did not know that. Uh, I believe there are more types of elites, yes. Yeah, like some of them are using the plasma pistols and stuff like that. Hold on a second, I'm pretty sure I'm gonna miss something. The game sends the voice. Uh, again, no Gamorami. Same guy. Is it? It is one thing to be struck in this cramped, smelly human ship. To be stuck, not struck. It is another thing to be ordered to fight alongside these brutes. They have no honor, and their combat tactics are simplistic, though brutally effective. Not dissimilar to the humans when they rush headfirst into battle with their antique weapons and primitive explosives. The commander seems to be indifferent to them. He says we are all on the path, the great journey and salvation foretold by the hierarchs. But despite what he says, I can tell these beasts make him uneasy. It is the hierarchs command that uh, they be given a more prominent role in combat, an unheard of order that could tear our covenant asunder if they are to intrude in our ro role of leaders of war. Yet they say it is a religious matter, and that all must be allowed to partake in the glory of combat and sacrifice in order to be worthy of the great journey. But what should I care? The more that, the more that enter combat and die, the better for us. I, for one, am content with letting these creatures destroy each other, long as it is Visangili who sees the glory, which is rightfully ours. Racist!
Um, there were various elites, even previously. There was the blue guys, the minor elites. There were the uh, red ones, which are the major elites. And then there were the uh, cloaked ones, which were, I believe, black. I've, I think they're called Spec Ops elites. Uh, golden elites were the zealots. And then there were the... No, the cloaked elites were actually grey. The black ops elites uh, were black. In black armor. Covenant assault carrier. There you go. That makes more sense. But wait, that still doesn't align with the initials. So, what the hell. Are they gonna not attack? Alright. They're grunts, so they do whatever. <laughs> Alright, any human data pads? No? Maybe? Any terminal I can click on? No? Maybe here? Oh, we got drinks, boys. USC data pad. Oh, man. From Captain Keys. I wonder what the chief thinks of who he is. Not the Master Chief as he is now, but rather the boy I knew as John. That was his name. I wonder sometimes if I had known what would have come of those children if I would have still helped. Still stayed silent. I've heard some describe Catherine, Catherine as a monster of what she did to those children. But she loved them all. She cared. She did it for what was at the time for the greater good. And in the end, her ugly gamble may be all that stands between us and extinction. Whoever that kid would have become, he's now for all purposes dead. He's the Master Chief now, and he still may be the sole person who can save us all. But all those other children, the ones we had to leave behind, they were burned alive as the Covenant glassed the planet. Forget about, about what I must be feeling. I don't know how the chief can keep it together. They're all gone. The only family he has ever had. Worst of all, he sent them down there. They died following his orders. I have faced the same reality countless times, but when I lead my ship into combat and certain death, I expect to die too. I hope I never have to feel the guilt of leading people to their death while I survive. But I do feel guilty because I too followed orders, and because of that, someone I love is now dead. I let Catherine stay down there. And didn't have to. Hmm. A chef's surprise? It's not the chief's surprise, so I don't want it. That would have been funny. Call it the master chef. Ho oh, ho ho. Oh, what is this? Health regen. Oh, battle rifle! Ooh, so many shots! Holy crap! And there's brutes up there. Man, this is. Hard as hell to aim. Holy, I got grenaded. I can't jump for some reason. Oh, we turned off the gravity here. Shit, son. Well, first F. There's a first time for everything, I guess. Are there going to be engineers? I actually do not know. I'm playing at 50 FOV? That sucks. Uh, I gotta fix it. 
Alright, let's get our ass back here. Oh, there's no uh, options here. Hold on, after this. What is happening there? What was that? I press fire mode. Is the gun kickback doing this to me? No grenades, that sucks. Man, the brutes are tough as hell. Is that like a warp grenade? That's so interesting. Alright, what other weapons? Oh, hello. Right. Good shot. I think the FOV setting is just gonna be problematic here because uh, I, I believe the game was designed for 4 to 3 and I actually will not be able to change it. But if I am able to change it then let me know please. Oh yeah, I did find that door. Shit! I was hoping that would hit the elite. I like the sound effect when you throw the grenade, that's so cool. Oh, right, it's not a plasma pistol, <laughs> shit, so... <laughs> oh, that was stupid. It's good that your health regens a bit. It's actually a really helpful mechanic. Okay, the hitbox on this thing is off. And the AoE on this is non-existent, so... Uh, yeah, I gotta be careful. What? Alright. I'm not sure I'm liking the brute shot, you have to be too accurate with it. And it just shoots forever. Alright. <laughs> We've learned the lesson with that one. Uh, did we activate that? Yes. That's how you switch the grenade type, great. Ah, I missed again. This is good to clear out the grunts, not against the elites. This is terrible against the elites. The battle rifle is pretty good against them though. No, I think it was just my inexperience with the gun that screwed me. I like how they spread up the plasma projectiles. It's actually taking some skill to dodge now. Yeah, brute shot absolutely horrible against elites. So we've learned that. My god, the accuracy.
I think that landed on his foot! Oh my god! Ah. I think that thing pulls people towards it. Oh wait, you aim it at the ground and then it works. Interesting. And the elite shields recharge really quickly. Alright. As my pistol, please. Still, the noob combo is just the easiest way to dispose of them. Let's see how this feels. Oh, it looks like the uh, Halo 2 version is really nicely done. Ooh, so from plasma shots, they is got changed into lasers. I like it. <laughs> Leads with T-Wagging. Whoa, they're cloaked! Uh, guys, I think I just... Guys? I broke the game. No! <laughs> What do I do now? Seriously, I broke it. Help! <laughs> I am unstable right now. Please. <laughs> Alright, let's get back. <laughs> no. Uh... But well, unless these guys made a way around, I have to restart. No. <laughs> a good time to look for an FOV option? Yes, indeed. We have to restart the level. <laughs> SPV we SPV three one Naka zero GG